Uh, we are with uh, Luke Bampton after the Celtic Gladiator 11 event. Uh, hello, Luke. I'm feeling great. Uh, a little sore, legs a little sore, but just uh, just glad that it's, it's it's done with now. I can go home and relax. Tonight you had a really tough uh, fight with uh, Marcin Stopka. Uh, really, really emotional fight uh, because uh, both of you gave uh, everything uh, in the ring. Uh, in your opinion, what was the reasons why you lose this fight? Um, I just feel like uh, the the better man won on the night, but um, definitely, definitely uh, a lot more experience than me. Um, Second round, um, I just couldn't match his tempo and power, and I started uh, running out of gas. And I think, yeah, my fitness let me down a little bit. Um, but yeah, just the, the better man won. You agreed with the statement that with each round, uh, you had uh, uh, Stopka had a bigger advantage? First, first round, uh, I felt like he just won, and then yeah, I, I just couldn't fight. I couldn't get into my rhythm. Um, I didn't fight how I'd like to, how I'd normally like to fight. But uh, on to the next one. You live and learn. So it's not really often that a foreign fighter had uh, so great uh, support from the audience. So, sorry, uh, what was that? Uh, big support from the audience yeah. uh, because uh, uh, last uh, part of your preparations you spent here in Krakow yeah. in uh, Wisła Club. So, what do you think about this club? Uh, what, what, what do you think about uh, their fighter? I um, absolutely love this club. Uh, everyone makes me feel uh, like I'm right at home. They make me feel like I'm a part of the team. Um, yeah, the Polish hospitality is amazing. I can't thank Thomas Serrata, my trainer, but also one of my best friends. And um, Magda, she's like my Polish mother for taking care of me and feeding me the last four weeks. Yeah, I absolutely love the Polish hospitality and everyone's so friendly. You proved tonight that the Aussie fighters are really tough. Uh, so, uh, of course, uh, Australia had a great uh, tradition with uh, Muay Thai, with kickboxing. Yep. Uh, obviously, fighters like uh, John Wayne Parr yep. or Paul Slowinski, who actually is a Polish guy but yep. trains he, in Australia. Uh, Paul, Paul actually fights out of my gym. Um, he trains at my gym back home. Um, he hasn't fought for two years or so now, but yeah, um, definitely uh, got a good team back home. I want to thank Jeremy Keeping, um, my, the head trainer, and also Richie Elliott, my, my boxing trainer. But yeah, the Rikers crew back home, they're so supportive and one of the best gyms in Australia for sure. You want to reach the careers like JWP or other great Australian fighters? I would love to, um, but yeah, right now, like, I'm just enjoying the ride. I love this sport. I just want to keep training, keep fighting, and just keep getting better. And maybe one day, who knows, just see what happens. Some message for Polish fans, for uh, supporters for, from uh, Wisła? Um, I hope you enjoy the fight. Sorry I couldn't perform how I'd like to, but hopefully I'll be back. And um, I'm, I'm definitely keen to come back and, and put on a show again. Okay, so thank you for interview. Thank you for an uh, amazing fight tonight. And we hope we see you again in our country, in Poland. Thank you, I really appreciate that. Thank you.